Hey, welcome back legends. So in the last video, we learned how to add picture in picture. Let's check it out right here. No audio, there it is, top right. I've got some Far Cry 4 footage and me meeting a bartender down in San Diego. So I think this is important because I see a lot of YouTubers doing this, like the outro to their videos. Uh, it'll be like subscribe to my channel or check out our new video. And it's much more engaging than just having like a subscribe button with text or a picture. If you see something moving around, it might catch your audience's eye a little bit more and engage them to click on that. And I think you're gonna have more success. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna add multiple pictures to our picture in picture. And it's the same process as we did before. I'm just gonna keep grabbing footage, putting it on top. You can do as many as you want. And this is the one of the bigger things that separates Final Cut Pro from iMovie. You can't do this in iMovie. This is one of the first things I was able to distinguish going from iMovie to Final Cut Pro. So what I'm gonna do is keep, make sure that we're on uh, distort, just like what we talked, I'm sorry, transform, uh, exactly what we talked about in the last video, how it, it scales it properly, four by three, four by three with the height, and then just go ahead and click on this and let's move it around. So let's go ahead and play it. You can actually do a couple more. Let's do, let me grab just more of this game footage right here. Blade tool, select it, bring it back. Now we are gonna have th one, two, three. We're gonna have the primary storyline and we're gonna have three on top of it. So I'm gonna go ahead and click on transform right here and let's put these in different corners just like that. So let's go ahead and play it. See what I'm saying? A lot of a lot of YouTubers have like, at the end of their videos, it'll be like, oh, subscribe here, or they'll have like a new video or a, a, most, a more recent video right here. You can click on that, it'll take you to the video. So good luck with this, hopefully this made sense. In the next video, I wanna talk about adding borders and adding effects to our picture in picture. So good luck and I'll see you guys over there.